Hey guys, I talk with Jay here, and this is just going to be my thoughts and reactions to uh, this uh, Final Fantasy VII uh, remake trailer. All right, let's go. So, oh the iconic flashback about? between Cloud and Tifa. When spring comes, I'm when they reminisce hell. back in uh, I'm going to Midgar, Seventh Heaven Bar. I'm going to be a soldier, the best of the best, like Sephiroth. Oh snap! It's Genova. What was that weird green eye for, though? Tell me, is it really you? I believe in the actual first encounter with the. Schedule? Please, Mr. President, Genova, I Seth am asking not there. you to reconsider. No begging. <sighs> director Twisty, the stench of the director's cowardice fills the room yet again. Mako super saturation confirmed. Engaging materia cooling to reduce temperature. Scarlet. You have a meeting shortly. Stop. She's always Your flooding. timing is impeccably atrocious. Oh Dang. Oh dear. They up her, uh, my refined taste up. running out of butter. <laughs> and the crazy old dude. Welcome to the Hunby Inn, Cloud. See, the thing about the Hunby Inn is I believe the owner was super buff, like... A thing without shame, to which notions of gender... World champ weightlifting lie. buff. Like Iron Man buff. Not a word. Not even one? No. But you're so pretty. Today I feel like they could have made Cloud like way better looking in drag. Huh? Which one of you said that? You got a Unless Don Corneo is totally the drag. Well, this might make a sense. A wonderful time kicking the hornet's nest. You know what I want. A second day. So who is Just this new guy and why did they add him? That's what I want to know. So what the hell is it? Red 13, oh, did it just talk? I am that which you see before you. Nothing more. I think they could have made Red 13's voice a little bit younger. Just because of the fact that he is old a touching reunion. due to uh, his lifespan, but explain he's a teenager. Very, very good. And thus is the hypothesis proven correct. I can only hope you will continue not. To Crazy old Hojo, <laughs> keeping an eye on Cloud. One of his experiments. I think Cloud is actually the first um, Mako and Fuse soldier to become successful in a laboratory, whereas Sephiroth was created through uh, actual birth using Genova cells rather than being infused with them, like Cloud was. Not your cover song. Big old chickens. People, and I know they're never gonna let Aerith go. She's the last living ancient on the planet. Dang. Crazy combo. This is the source of everything. Genova. <laughs> Battle system looks lit. I don't like this. Suck on this. Big shot. Old motorcycle chasing. <gasps> then when they escape the uh, the falling great on that cable. Nice. I promise you, there's a much bigger threat. I just want to do everything in my power to help all of you. And if you ever watched the anime Akira, like you can see a lot of the resemblance of where they were inspired in between Seven and Akira. Man, this is gonna be great. At first, I was actually expecting to be uh, disappointed by uh, the 7 remake, only because most remakes or updates are uh, highly disappointing, to be honest. Um, either they take too long to make it, and they miss the mark, which it's literally been like 22 years after the fact, but uh, they do have a lot of in-between with like Dirge of Cerberus, uh, Crisis Core... Advent Children, uh, Dissidia. Uh, there's even a few cell phone games I think only Japan got. Uh, the, it was the OVA New Order. So it's gotten a lot of, well, Seven's gotten a lot of attention. I mean, Cloud even makes appearances in Final Fantasy Tactics, Chocobo's Dungeon 2. There was even rumors that uh, you could not acquire him as a party member in, I believe it was Final Fantasy X, but rather he would sell you... Uh, items and weapons which was uh, that's pretty neat but uh 
I believe that turned out to be completely false. Even um, a lightning uh, has gotten um, cloud skins. We've also seen cloud in um, what was it? Uh, Smash Bros. Man, that was pretty epic. And he's got all his limit breaks. What else? Seven's gotten a lot. I mean, just in general, Seven has gotten a lot of love. There was an arcade game called Air Guys. I remember when my uh, my friend Jim told me about that, and I think it was during the same year Seven was released. Well, uh, maybe the next year after. I'm not entirely sure, but uh, he I remember him telling me at school that he had seen uh, Final Fantasy Seven as an arcade game in our local Kmart, which was weird because I did first of all I didn't think our Kmart had a little bit of an arcade, and then uh, secondly I'm like, dude, Seven is an RPG on the PS One. There's no way that there's a fighting game for it. I mean, but this is like way back in the day in '97 where like the internet was was new and like it was just a desert basically and not many people had internet or computers for that matter because they were so expensive it just depended on you know your lifestyle and uh, cloud even appears in um he even appears in world of final fantasy i mean it, seven had just been iconic in general just because the fact that it was the transition from 2d to 3d it was a big thing back in 97 and great storyline. I mean, of course, uh, the Final Fantasy series has always been known for a great storyline and promotion video. But uh, I guess I'm going to go ahead and end it there for now. And uh, uh, just to let you guys know, I am doing a playthrough of the original uh, 7 game back from 97 on my uh, PS2 on disc. Uh, just to give it that 100% uh, old school authentic feel. So if you want to learn more facts, uh, brush up or learn... Or just not play the game and uh, get get all the information you need. Please uh, check out my uh, go ahead and check out my playthrough. I'll, I'll be playing throughout the weeks until uh, seven is released on uh, April tenth. All right, guys, this is Otaku J signing out. Have a good one.